Hello and welcome to my first YouTube cash stuffing video. My name is Emily and I am 21 years old. I work full time as a kitchen assistant at a resort in the southwest of the UK and today I'll be stuffing 703 pounds. Before I start I will be counting that out just to triple check it's the correct amount 20 40 60 81 20 40 60 82 20 40 60 83 20 40 60 84 20 40 50 60 70 80 90 500 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 600. 10, 20, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, 97, 98, 89, 701, and 703 pounds. I've been cash stuffing for one and a half years now and I've been wanting to start up a YouTube channel for a couple months now but I've been very nervous about doing so so I'm finally starting now I do all of my pre-budgeting on good notes on my iPad and I get paid every four weeks and so I do this once every four weeks. This paycheck was from the 20th of May this year and will go on until I think it's the 17th or 18th of June. To begin I'll be starting with my wallet which I've just bought on Amazon. with spending I'm gonna put 20 pounds in here and the remaining amount I will be putting in another one of my in another one of these uh, to change out each week for food that's just for takeaway so I put in 35 pound each week and again I'll put it in another envelope to change out the money each week. For gas, I've budgeted for £37 each week. And that's all that will be in there. Of those categories, I roll over gas each week in hopes of getting as full of a tank as I can as well as my spending money any rolled over money will go into my uh, Emily sinking fund with my wallet down I'm going to go on to my easy spenders which I've got in this I got this from the Disney store in London and my favourite Disney characters are Tinkerbell and Peter Pan, hence why I have a Peter Pan themed one. Okay. So the first envelope here is my Emily fund. I have £5 in there and I'll be adding £10. This £10 is um, left over from last paychecks spending money so now I have 15 pound I have a new fund for Blake who is my boyfriend of five years there's nothing in there um, as I've only started it this paycheck next is clothes clothes is not getting anything and there's nothing in there either this envelope is from 
Amazon. I got it alongside my uh, wallet. This envelope is the same. It's from Amazon with the wallet. Uh, it's for sports. And in this one, I have £25. And I'll be adding £5 to sports, so I now have 20 25 30 pounds for sports i like to do tennis swimming and running i do those on and off the most frequent one at the moment is running as i'm a part of the hoovian running club though they are shutting down at the end of the year so i'll probably have to find a new one um this fund is my gifts fund which is out of order because this one should be next, which is my tattoo fund. There's nothing in there. And these envelopes are ones that I've made myself. Yeah, uh, gifts, I'll be adding 10 pound and it has 20, 30, 45 at the moment. So I now have 20, 30, 40, 50, 55 pound in gifts. I'll just write in all of these. Next will be my short term savings, which I keep all of my savings in this binder. Um, it's just blue butterflies from uh, WH Smith. I got it a couple years ago now. And all the envelopes in here I've either made myself or from Amazon when I got my uh, wallet. So starting with car insurance. I'm just going to zoom in on there. So for car insurance, I have £40. I've also made these trackers myself. Um, yeah, nothing special, just paper printed. So I have 100, 100, 200, 300, 20, 40, 60, 80, 400, 20, 40, 60, 80. 85 90 and I will be adding 40 pound let me just recount that these fake notes are from Amazon I just use them to count up the money that I've already deposited into the bank and then this one I've just made myself because I didn't, British money does not have 100 or 1,000 pounds. There's, there's no options for those. And the 50 pound notes are quite rare themselves. So I do have a couple of homemade placeholders for those as well. Yeah, so now I have in car insurance 100, 200, 300, 20, 40, 60, 80, 400, 20, 40, 60, 80, 500, 20, 30, 40. So I have 540 pound in car insurance now. My goal is to reach 700 pound and I pay this yearly in January. Next up is car maintenance. I'll be adding 20 pound to that one. Car maintenance has 120, just one? 120, 40, 60, 80, 200. 
20, 40, 60, 70, 70, no, 80. Oh, I need to recount that. 1, 20, 40. Two hundred and ninety pound in car maintenance. That's just to cover the cost of MOTs, um, servicing. Uh, I also use it to replace wind wipe, windshield wipers. Um, yeah, just general car stuff. Next up is road tax which I need to save up 165 this year, but I've put a goal of 200 pound. That way I've definitely got the amount I need. I'll be adding 10 pound to that one today. Okay, so 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 20, 30. Again, uh, this one, actually no, this one is not a January, this one's a December payment, but my goal is to save up by November, that way I can focus on others. Okay, next up is Christmas, um, I did break my wallet for that one, I think, oh no I didn't, I thought I had broke it, but I didn't. This is one I've most recently made because I've recently bought a laminator and so I've been teaching myself how to make envelopes. My goal is eventually to make an Etsy account to be able to sell these things because I do find this very fun. So Christmas is getting £40 so twin, and it has 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40. My goal is to reach £500 in time for Christmas, um, but I don't have very many people I have to buy for, so I might just only save up for £300, which is what I've done last year, and that was plenty. Next up is anniversary. My anniversary with my boyfriend is in March. Um, my goal is to save up £100 just for a meal out, uh, but I've not started it yet and it has £0. Okay, next up is birthday. Oh, it's gone quite dark out. It's about to rain. Next up is birthday. I'll be putting £30 in there. Currently has 10. So 20, 30, 40. Uh, 20, 30, 35, 40. 40 pound. This is to save up for my uh, girls trip in late July with my boyfriend's sister and cousin. We're going to be seeing Harry Potter and the Cursed Child and I'm very excited. Next up is TV license. I split this bill with my boyfriend's other sister's fiance because we live together and we're the only ones that use like BBC and stuff like that. I'll be putting five pound in there today. So that now has 20, 40, 50, five. My goal is to reach 100 pound on this one. Uh, because my share, I believe, is £77. Okay. Oh, what was that? I should have written that down. 55 Next up is Dentist. Um, I do have an envelope. For that. I've only just started this one. I've... Yeah, there's nothing in there, so... But I do need to start going to the dentist a bit more often with COVID. We weren't able to go and I've since procrastinated going. Heating oil, my goal is um, £160 every six months. Um, 
However, given uh, the increase in gas prices lately, I'm likely to have to increase this to every three months or so. So I'm adding 30 pounds into heating oil today. So that now has 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 30, 40, 50. That's really close, sweet. Next up is opticians. I wear glasses, so I, I'm i really late on getting my eyes checked. Pretty sure my prescription's changed, but not 100% certain. Um, currently has nothing in it because again, I've only just started this one this month. Same with a Cricut machine. I really want to get a Cricut. That has nothing. I've started um, today. next up is my long-term goals i have my house deposit in a separate binder which is this one it's a linen top and my goal is to be able to get a nice house one day um this is like my dream house sort of envelope thing um so i'm adding in 40 pound today i'm doing that in 220 pounds because ten pa uh, twenty pound will be going into my house deposit section. Okay, so house deposit now has one thousand five hundred, six hundred, seven hundred, eight hundred. Oh, I've lost count. So five. Six, seven, eight, nine hundred, fifty, seventeen, ninety, one thousand. Yeah, uh, one thousand and twenty. So that's two thousand twenty actually. Oh. I need to get a calculator. Okay, so 220 in the deposit section. I think I've done that right. And then I was also stuffing. My office room category because I would very much like to have a house where I have my own personal office and I am working on filling that out at the moment I'm putting in for a new desktop because I like to change out the top of my IKEA desk quite often so that'll be getting the other 20 that I've misplaced okay so 2020 is probably correct but I'll be putting 20 in there, so I'll have 50 pound in my office category. Okay. Okay, next up is emergency fund. I've put this one on the back burner for a while because I did have to spend all of the contents of this a couple months ago when our washing machine broke and I didn't have much in there to begin with. Um, so I'll be adding five pound today, and I had five pound in the bank, so now I have ten pound. Next is holiday. I have nothing in there, but my goal is to save up three hundred this year at least. Um, I plan to go to the US with my sister to go visit our grandmother. Next is wedding. I'm not engaged. Um, I just want to save up for hopefully one day getting married. 
because it's something I will show in the future that is £10. My goal is to save up £600. There's no time frame in which I want to achieve this though. Next is one week ahead. This is one I started last week, uh, last paycheck. I'll be adding five pound to that one. That is 10, 20, five. So in this envelope, I put the remaining amount for my wallet. So this one receives gas. So Those are the, yeah, that's what I do to get the correct amount, um, which I know is messy, but it's the easiest way for me to keep track of these amounts. So I have 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 95. Oh, dear Lord. One hundred and eleven pound, I think, if I can add correctly. I need to get a calculator, but I'm very broke in comparison to everyone else I live with. Um, next would be groceries. Um, I just put thirty five pound in for each week. So that is three of each note. Okay, so that's 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 95, 105. And in this one, I put the remainder of my spending money. Okay, that's sixty pound. Okay, and that's it for this binder. And lastly, oh, what's this one? find out in a bit but oh yeah challenge lastly I do the 100 envelope challenge but I've switched it up a bit I changed out um some of the numbers so most of them are in multiples of five but I've got five random numbers throughout the box today I'll be stuffing 85 that's 20 30 40 50 60 70 80 five pounds I do this challenge with my boyfriend because we're hoping to save up um, enough money to get a good house deposit and this is one of our fun ways of going about it so we write our names on the back when we filled it and let the other person add to it when they can. Okay, so that is it for my cash stuffing today. I hope you enjoyed the video and feel free to subscribe if you like. Um, yeah, I hope you enjoyed. Thank you for watching. Bye!